And in local coverage this evening, week three of the Arizona testing blitz swung into action early this morning at drive through cl clinics across Yuma County. News 11's Cody Lee joins us from Yuma Civic and Convention Center, where the largest clinic was held. Cody, did we see another day of long lines? We did indeed, April. Testing started at 8 this morning, but by 9.45, they were all out of tests. Not good news for those at the end of the line, but good news for the fight against coronavirus. YRMC has now screened more than 600 Yuma County residents. If you even feel a little bit sick, then come on out and do it. You know, it, it doesn't hurt, doesn't cost. Another busy weekend at the Civic Center. Drivers lined up in hopes of getting tested for coronavirus. Last Saturday, we had a very large turnout, and it looks like we have an even bigger turnout today. Some people reached the clinic before sunrise to make sure they got screened. The earliest person today arrived at 415. In spite of the hot Yuma sun, nurses and frontline medical personnel all wore the essential PPE. They let me try it on, not too comfortable in the Arizona heat. Nurses say making victories in the fight against coronavirus is worth the discomfort. COVID-19, there's a lot of things that we don't yet know about it, but what we do know is that it spreads quickly and being able to know whether or not you're positive will help protect not only the, the community, but your family. Um, and it's just, it's a responsible thing to do. After each test is administered, nurses will take off their gloves, sanitize, and then re-glove for the next vehicle. Sanitation after each sample is a key step in keeping both the public and healthcare workers safe. The Arizona Testing Blitz Initiative has been very successful in Yuma County. And while this is the last scheduled testing event for the hospital, YRMC will continue to look for more opportunities to provide testing. As the situation continues to evolve, there are ongoing conversations about what would be the next right steps for us as an organization, for the city, and for the governor's office to support testing. Also supporting their efforts, members of the community fearful for their health. I think it's great. I think it's awesome. We thank all the volunteers and everyone that has come out to, to take care of this. And on Friday, state health officials announced they were extending the testing blitz for two more weeks. So that can mean YRMC might be coming back out here to the Civic Center for additional testing. We'll keep you updated. For additional testing clinics, log on to our website, kyma.com. Click on the coronavirus page. Reporting in Yuma, I'm Cody Lee, News 11. Well, thank you for that, Cody.